The Dark Lord has spoken. The hairs are rotten, old time hashes, all their manners foul and cool, like some rotting blue vein beneath the force of the world. Take it down, Mother Duck. Oh, you're right. Say how you are. Oh, Do we have any visiting hashers? Yeah. Any visiting hashers? Yes, there is some. Uh, a few visitors. Come on in, visiting hashers. Don't be shy. Very there's not many visitors. Behind you, GM. Answer do. Where are you at? Dicky Enormous. Dicky Enormous. He's a visitor. From Patia. Who's Dicky Enormous from Patia? Believe Dicky Enormous from Patia. Where's he? Thanks. Can you shut the dogs in? Can you close the window, please? Well, who are you, sweetheart? Where are you from? Indiana. Oh, oh. That's a gringo. Oh, oh well. A yank is an animal with no brains or wits. Her education's total shit. They class of English isn't worth a lot. They get confused between the fanny and the twat. And if you'd rather have a jerk off than a wank, you could grow up to be a yank. Bring it down, Of course, that wouldn't apply to you, madam. Was that a smile or was that gas? Okay, hello. She's got a Okay, do we have any cherry hashers? Yeah. First time. Come on in, you guys. Jesus, get out of the way! Oh, yeah, I'll get, I'll get one. Alright, where are you from? Okay, let's find out their names and where we're coming from. Who are you? What? Cheryl Manila. Another guy. You are? Tom? Hello. Straight from England? Turn around and face your fucking song. Listen, we've only got two rules in our hack. Rules one, and no, one, rule six. And they are. And if you yanks and don't know what pufters are, you'll find out if you go down the Come around the day's place and all. No pufters, no pansies, no platonic thinkers, bum boys or brown hatters, or hand on hip drinkers. We don't really like that on Angelis hash. If you need a conversion, try some Angelis hash. Bring it down. Over your head, if you don't drink it, over there. it not going to be my attention that the other week, George wanted to bring the honeycomb into the circle. I said, this is not a cherry hasher, but you wanted to bring it in and introduce us to him. Come on, just lost it, Sherry. George, bring your honeycomb in. Come on, George. And your name is? Vilma. From? Vilma from Samoa. Where from Samoa? Eastern Samoa. Where from Samoa? What's she getting it for? What is she getting it down there for? Oh, we're just introducing her to the circle. 
Is this the first she's time she's never been, been brought into the Angelus Circle Angela before? Angela. Even she's, she's, she's a cherry oh, hunter. Oh, Don't worry. So, hey, all right. All right. Boy, love, you have a song and we drink it and put it over your head. She's all right. She's all right. She's a little black Jessie, but she's all right. Come on, drink it. That was gone before. I don't know where you are. Hey, uh, Jojo. <laughs> Maybe they are holding some back. <laughs> yeah, I see a coat there too. Well, why didn't George let his missus get into the circle before? Hey, hey, yes, long time Asha, you know the rules. You're responsible. Get in the middle. He brings his butt and the rest of the Get it. Get in the middle, you bastard. Oh, they're out there because you didn't drink at all? You don't bring your lady in the hash? Here's a song for George. Georgie Porgy Puddin and Pie Kissed the girls and made them cry The boys came out to give him help So Georgie kissed the boys as well <laughs> Okay. Uh, <laughs> just now we saw an example of a, an, indigenous inhabit, an indigenous inhabitant who couldn't remember where they came from. And yesterday I came across an even more odd case. I went to the dentist. The man had been a student in the USA for a year. So I said to him, where did you go to college? No and he said, I don't know. Who <laughs> <laughs> was that? Uh, no, I can't remember his name, David. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, I have been asked to explain the unusual apparitions here, and I'm sorry to say that I can't, but these things are historical. My first visit to the Philippines, 1979, there was a most interesting article in one of the Manila papers, which read something like this. <coughs> Title, Mystery <coughs> Hole. Residents of such and such a street in Fall Park, McCarthy, were amazed when they left their homes for work yesterday morning. There was a three meter hole in the ground there, which had not been there the night before. A spokesman for the engineering department said, we have no idea how it arose. The police spokesman said, we are looking into it. <laughs> <laughs> Last week we had a lot of people because there were a lot of children here, and children generally bring happiness to parents, parents want children. Some people, however, get children that they don't want, some children get parents that they don't want, <laughs> and some people can't have children at all. This is called infertility. And according to a recent study in the USA, infertility may be hereditary. <laughs> <laughs> I did not invent this, this was on one of the TV programs. Now, uh, Are you sure that wasn't the Filipino newspaper? No, it was. What's that chap with the big chin? Jimmy Hill. Douglas. Jimmy Hill. Fred Flintstone. Something that could be useful for you if you're planning to learn Tagalog. You might be able to learn it as fast as the people here learn English. How many of you know Zeppelin Street? Yes. Right, Zeppelin Street is in Hensonville. And there is a miraculous Christmas bargain there. According to the Blue Book, it contains an educational establishment which is so good it can only be described as miraculous. Their advert claims that you can learn to speak Tagalog in one week. Hmm? Now, that long? Hey Joe, where are you from? Chris gets a deal with him, mate. Yeah, mate, it's so sad. Get get the circle. Where's your name come from? Oh, she's fucking. I like to talk about it. Main night. Quiet. I'm not talking.
If you are learning English, usually it's a four-year course, and simplified it's something like this. First year is nouns, second year is verbs, third year is pronouns, and fourth year is the rest. So the uh, course material is something like this. Year one, money. Year two, give money. money. Year three, give me money. And if you get to the fourth year, it's please give me money. You've got the joke, but... You might get through your Tagalog Oh, right. Doggy Dave, you get this. What's the other? Literacy test as well. Uh, where is soft talk? Soft talk. Hey, I didn't be I know. Yes. Sunshine John. Yeah. Sunshine. Oh, we're not doing the 12 days of Christmas. That we are doing the 12 days of Christmas and abbreviated version. Wait, who's in the first verse? When is 12th night? How short is it? Oh, 12th night after the 20th. Oh, I'll take that one. Wish to come oh, to yeah, the ATM, that's fine. So, when is 12th night, folks? 6th of January, the Epiphany. Uh, no, this is... Uh, oh, I don't have it on this one, so... 3rd of January, it's today. Wednesday the 6th, so we are on the... We're on the 8th day today. No, 7th. 9th. Three counts? No, it's a Okay, it's too bad. What are we going to do? On, on my first. All of us, and we all sing together. Well, those who've got the text, those who haven't got it, can't read it properly. If you come here, you can join in. On, on my first day, day in Angeles, my true love gave to me. One BJ and a short time in Santos Street, not Santos Street. <laughs> On the second day of Christmas, my true love gave to me two blacklists banking, one BJ and a short time in Santos Street. On the third day of Christmas, my true love gave to me three three holders. Two backless banking, one BJ, and a short time and some sum. On the fourth day of Christmas, my true love came to me. Four, four, four skins, three, three holders, two backless banking, one BJ, and a short time and some On the fifth day of Christmas, my true love came to me. Five street girls, four full of policemen. On the six days of Christmas, my true love came to me. Six and the girls, five street girls, four four skins, three three hearts. And a short time in Santos Street. Please join in. On the seventh day of Christmas, my true love came to me. Seven street vendors, six and the girls, five street girls. Four, four skins, three, three holders, two backers of banking, one BJ, and a short time in Santos Street. <laughs> On the eighth day of Christmas, my true love came to me. Eight hundred bills, seven street vendors, six and girls, five street girls, four, four skins, three, three holders. Two backers of banking, one BJ, and a short time in Santos Street. On the ninth day of Christmas, my true love came to me. Nine big beggars, eight hundred pills, seven street vendors, six San Miguel's, nine street girls, four four skins, three three holders, two backers of banking. One BJ and a short time in Santos On the tenth day of Christmas, my true love came to me. A girl sang to me, and the girl gave me an injection. Let's get to this tune. Oh, let's. 
What about the traditional shit? A dose of a clap, and then you decline. Oh, oh my goodness. And the French net are full of feeding. Oh, let's get Probo back and do it, do it properly. We've got a couple of days to spare. Fucking hell. Colin Green, on it. That's not Colin Green, that's Anonymous. I beg your pardon. Anonymous, that's his name. Oh, he's the bloke in the hat song book. Hey! 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 Uh, now, uh, uh, the scales have fallen from my eyes, and I understand now the origin of a recent email which had no sender on it. To the Angeles Touch, I wish to protest most strongly against the conduct of affairs in the circle. It seems utterly hidebound by ancient conventions, e.g. that hashers of 40 years standing should wear hash shirts, and that should people should carry whistles. When a youthful new recruit proposes a stimulating activity with one's tongue, that old crab of an RA pours scorn on it. Where did you dig that, antidil uh, that antediluvian fossil? By the way, <laughs> this... You didn't this write this yourself, did you? It looks a bit out of date <laughs> now. <laughs> to demonstrate my displeasure, I shall not do another hash this year. Signed. Anonymous. <laughs> what have we got? Is this a down down? Thank you for telling me. Let me know in the future. What has we done wrong? If he's funny, let us use your ears, you know. What? Who's that? Uh, genital exaggeration? No. He said he comes from South Korea or somewhere. He's probably gone. Oh, that blood there! That's him! He's probably tired! Okay. He's from where? Oh, there he says, I thought he says, must be from the German part of Korea. Okay. Well, he's German, he comes from Korea. <laughs> You're a big, strong lad, right, Gobble? German hatches are the strongest, their early trails, they were the longest. Our group of ever on earth, on back at Stalingrad. <laughs> Okay. Let's do it after the 
Holy Horn. Everybody on your knees and I'm not a jump this note. <laughs> jump this note. What the hell is that mean? Do we have any stories for the Holy Horn? I have, I have such a story, Grandmaster. <laughs> we had amongst us a person who's been watching too many Manny Pacquiao fights. You think he's a fight promoter? During this week, I was walking past the Bunny Ranch for another hasher. And this guy said, hey, there's going to be a fight. And there's four people at the end. And I said to this hasher, this is going to spark off in five seconds. I said, I bet the bananas hit the fucking floor first. Three seconds, boosh, bang, crash, what? Yes. Promoter, short circuit. I was there, I saw it. <laughs> it's it's going to be a fight, watch. <laughs> About 50 Filipinos are all there. This younger Filipino Australian Eric decked this uh, silly man. And some Filipino rushed out to get the police. And wow. went upon the, the culprit's fight and come out and said, Fuck off, quick for the police. <laughs> <laughs> so they went that way and Shulk Circuit went that way. And the guy said, This damage, this damage. <laughs> all right. Well, he's got an excuse, mate. He's got an excuse, mate. He is Australian. I mean, so fit. And Aussies are an not the cold in his hat. And he'd rather suck on this than suck on that. He keeps a room for an and a dingo for a dog. He can't think at all, cause he's missing a cog. So if you're thick and your mankins are a shocker, you could grow up to be a knocker. Where's the next promotion? Where's the next promotion? Where's the next promotion? Where's the next yeah. I think we had a rather startling revelation the other night from FC Mick, who claimed to have inherited a transvestite from Crazy German. Oh, dear! <laughs> oh, dear! It was, uh, it was uh, you know, a boasting about the things that the transvestite I wonder where the was promising come to from. do to him. And, uh, <laughs> Quite interesting. Uh, <laughs> actually, at the end of the story, you know, whether or not this came well, to be. Well, Bird turned up. Where was it, Mick? <laughs> it's frustrating, eh, Mick? It's frustrating. Oh, no, crazy Joe, I never got that far. <laughs> the last lap of the spell is it when we get in the show. Well, I hear you fucking <laughs> fat. You fat <laughs> homosexual cunt. What I want to know is <laughs> missus turned up. Is that like when you have a fucking. Beautiful, sexy dream, and then you wake no, up. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> From behind, it looked like a bird. He said, Come and meet my mate. Yeah, all right. It turned out to be a geezer. And he said, I'm just going to the toilet, and he fucked off home. And he's going to sit on my fucking lap. <laughs> 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 There are many transvestite songs for Subic, but the old traditional one from Rangelis is, is. No. Oh, fuck, I can't remember the last <laughs> Fuck it. Up from Subic City comes a girl who's very keen to give oral masturbation to the sexually in between. She loves to chew the fat with a Subic hash. Though she's got a knob where she should have a gash. She's the most eccentric gentleman and she calls herself Maureen.
He kept that quiet, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't think he's got long oh, sure shots on him. Hey, come on. Right, no, one night you'll be dreaming and we'll come back here lovely. <laughs> we'll we wake up the harder and have a week. He did go on a long shot. Well, let's do sitting from the floor and just do it yourself then, shall we? I'll take your bars off and give it a miss. You'll take a cup of coffee. A number of fellow hashes went to La Bamba to join the night. On in walked HIV with his typical bag of sweets and candy for the girls. And he had some uh, candy dummies, like children's dummies. They lit up and he was handing these out to all the girls. And the girls on stage were sucking them and demonstrating what they would do to other parts of the male anatomy. And with great disgust, I looked around and I saw three fellow male hashes sucking on them as well. <laughs> <laughs> on in, yeah. and Moses, Cherry Godfather. Oh, I knew uh, uh, oh. Oh. Yeah. 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 just demonstrated what they like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I never sucked any. Oh, oh, I never oh, sucked oh, any. Oh, 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 a representative from each country. All right. Hey, hang on, no, 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 it is a song I just wrote today, right, for the new songbook. Turn around, lad. Anyone sucks on lollipops has got to be a bit of a fucking pedo, hey? <laughs> this one is a traditional tune of a traditional English nursery rhyme called Boys and Girls Come Out to Play. Boys and Girls Come Out to Play. Let Peter the Potiphar have his way. Come into my car. I've got, I've got lots of treats, chocolate ice creams and lots of sweets. Oh, fucking hell, here comes your mum and dad. Oh, fuck off quick and things are turning bad. Bye-bye, kids, I'll hit the trail. They catch me again, it's ten years in the trail. <laughs> <laughs> that was only a new one. Work in progress. <laughs> Okay, who else? Uh, I don't know what you're doing. You said there was somebody who lost a hat. Come on. BD over there. Who was it that lost a hat? Clark Kent. Clark Kent. Clark Kent. Clark Kent. Clark Kent. Where is he? Clark Kent. Where is he? Where is his hat? Is it true? Now, someone was ahead of me. And I thought, yeah, that's Clark Kent. There's his hat. I said, Clark. oi, Darren, your hat's here. He said, what, my cat? <laughs> <laughs> well, it could be nice. <laughs> 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 he's fucking here, he's hot. No, he's looking for his cat. He's a pervert. <laughs> <laughs> he's a pervert. Huh? Hey, hey, hey. Man in black. You're a pervert. Sometimes. You've done lots of perverted things. Sometimes. I still think I'd better get... No, the Le Lily the Leper, the new song. <laughs> Lily the Leper sat firmly on my face and it gave me quite a fat till she blew a string of fanny fat and then I started to smell a rat. <laughs> her vagina was connected internally to her lower bowel I had to sprue and brush my teeth before I gave her another growl. <laughs> yes, so I'm working on it, I'm working on it. <laughs> Diamond's not right yet. All class, all low class. Low class. Last Sunday, guys, girls, I left Hash here. I was offered a lift home by Minsky Tide. Now, I was put through probably one of the most harrowing situations I've ever had in Ganguly City. Now, we got down to a satellite. I was seated in the back of the vehicle. Got down to the satellite, turned left, and all of a sudden, mental cycle was pulled in by some guy coming out of the woods and wearing a uniform. The guy said, You've just turned left from a red light. Now, the language that came out of mental cycle is now. It wasn't dirty, was it? It's only fucking Christmas. You're fucking not getting a cent out of me, mate. We know what you're fucking doing. And then sitting at the back was Mazza. 
something. Now the words that come out of Baz's mouth were fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> <laughs> you don't fucking like it. We're going to go around and see Uncle fucking Kevin at the Barangong. Now later on I asked him who Uncle Kevin was. <laughs> he said, I just made up the fucking <laughs> yeah. so, so it didn't fucking matter. <laughs> But come on in, Kentucky. It's probably the worst language to come out of any of the people. Oh, no. no. An American gentleman. Well, I have mannered, Kentucky. Nobody's worse than that. Ball, like, like, this guy looked like one of the beggars in, you know, Santa's Street right when Cherry Godfather goes past making money off the beggars, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but anyhow, Kentucky's into the blood. Listen, mate, you're not getting a fucking cent out of us. And the bloke says, look, just pull over, I want to look at your license. Kentucky's into the bloke, poor bastard again, you know. You're not going to get his fucking license, mate. We're not donating to your fucking Christmas, mate. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, with that, we're fucking off. We'll see you at the Baron Guy. And there I am, I'm dumbfounded. I don't know what's fucking going on, you know. You was the driver. I the of the community. And these two, like, and then I look back over me shoulder, and there's this poor fucking copper. You're saying in that one. Oh, that was his kid's fucking Christmas stock. <laughs> yeah, right. 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 Master, it was fucking disgraceful. Right. <laughs> well, thank you, out of this bloke's fucking. Head. There's only one song for anyone called Kentucky. Ho! Oh, oh, way down, down south in the land of cotton. The boy fucks his sister, his mother ain't forgotten. Look away! Look away! Look away! Look away. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, well, Those kids got no choice of Christmas. Yeah, well, <laughs> Fall down that fucking hole, go on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Gypsy, but you've got to do a down down. What for? For rescuing Anonymous from falling in that bloody sink. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> well, at least you've got to do a down down or what? Yes. Yes, go on. Grab the bit. Push him down. <laughs> I got it. You want to come down the hall? This is I've got a um, <laughs> I've got a song for Gypsy. Although I hope Ash Insurance covers me because she'll fucking kill me. I've known this girl for 25 years. Well, I've been scared of her for 25 years. <laughs> no, I didn't meet you for 25 years. No. Thirty. That's only uh, eighteen years. Hey, listen, love. Seems like twenty-four. I'll tell you something will make him laugh a bit more. <laughs> oh, the nice girls love oh, a candle. Oh, 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 the nice girls love a wick. Cause there's something about a candle that's like an artificial prick. It's fat and greasy, slips and easy. It's a girl is pride and joy. When she's dancing round about with a candle up a cloud. Oh, what joy! Oh, what joy! No, cut the cunt word out with like, <laughs> I don't want to fucking die. What? Like dildo dog? Doesn't matter. You, you bring it up, she'll kill you instead of me. Can you hang out? No, we'll, we'll add something. Yeah. Well, we have a oh. couple of Grinches until Christmas. As you know, and you're involved. <laughs> Come on, single mild in here. You know that there were I'll lots of Christmas, every week. New Year, uh, Christmas Eve parties. Bob. Well, the atheists gathered out at uh, Kansas with Dog's Place for a lot of Christmas parties. So none of them being believers. You come on in. Oh, so you know, he's not well known, but he's the black hand of the hash. You know, and what happened is, during, oh. the, during the evening, Doggy Dave was heard to say to... Single malt here. You know, single malt. The more cripples you eradicate in 2010, the greater I will be pleased. <laughs> Did he say no? Did he say no? I've eradicated enough. He said, "Okay, I'll do it." <laughs> <laughs> right. It's a total fucking mystery. What are you fucking saying? <laughs> All right. I'll sing on my own down down song. Oh, oh no, you do. A jock is an animal that speaks double Dutch, and they don't like the English very much. Their favourite game is football. They think it played fine, but in every World Cup they give it by the Irishman's side. And if you don't want your race to be a mess. 
Don't call a Scotsman's kilt a dress. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, mate. I don't know what the fuck you're You're a pathological liar, are you? Oh, fuck. You're talking to one of You believe it. I believe it. See, you believe it. I can hear him saying what he said, but I don't believe it. Black shirt, yeah, Jack, I believe yeah. it. Yeah. Jack, you mean to put? Mm. Okay. It's a boy to have blue shoes. Yeah. 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 2,200 pesos with 20% discount. Yeah. 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 Y
I mean, any returning hashes yet? Yeah, there's millions of them. Do we have any returning hashes? Yeah. Thousands of them. Thousands of them. Dirty Al, when did you come back? I'm going to go on to the province Tuesday, but I'm coming back Friday. So. No, when did you come back? Is it your first time back? No, two weeks ago, but I got out of there. <laughs> oh, how many fucking returning ashes we got? There's a lot, huh? Well, hang on, what about you? Were you... Two weeks ago. <laughs> Is she a returner or what? Uh, yeah, she's been here. Ten. Appalachia. Because all these bastards want cheap beer. How many have you got? Anyone can count? Anyone well. numerous? Thirteen. Thirteen. Right. Turn round, face the coin master. Rusty, he's totally a big fucking bitch. Then you Right. How many? Thirteen. Eleven. How many? Eleven. He says eleven, he says thirteen. He's counting gypsy right, and Put him in, make it fucking twelve. <laughs> Ten. Ten. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ten returning hashes back in town once more. Do us all a favor, go away once more. Go away tomorrow, we really wish you would. Next time when you go away, please stay away for good. Right, get out of the circle, stop wasting our time. Watch out to the holes. Watch yeah. the holes. Okay, we have any reporting hashers. Your hole is too big. Oh, I am. Oh, yeah. Watch it. It's a gym. <laughs> what is it? The partner. Yeah, the robot went to the partner. Oh, cabbage fat. Cabbage fat. Anyone else? Yeah. 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 It's a long way to your homeland. It's a long way to go. It's a long way to your homeland. From where the girls all suck and blow. So, goodbye to your butterflies. Farewell to your tots. It's a long, long way to your homeland. So, fuck off, quick smart. Uh, roll the checks to um, Sunshine John over there. Next week's run! Next week's run! T-shirt! 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 Next week's run! Next week's run! Next week's run! Anchorage! 1.30 cripples, 2.30 normals. Where the fuck is the anchorage? Okay. Do we have any t-shirts? That's where the good restaurant is there. What? Um, speak. Don't be uncruel. <coughs> oh, Homer Simpson on in. Sunshine John, appropriate song, please. Pinky. I can't think. You're disappointed, Alma. I don't care. Well, okay, I'll sing a song. Okay, okay, the Grand Marshal will sing a song. Knock, knock. Who's there? Banana. Banana who? Banana. 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 Okay, now, Sunshine John, second one. You fucking your turn. Knock, knock! Who's there? Orange! Orange, you! Orange, you damn, I didn't say banana! Banana, na! Banana, na, 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 na! Sunshine John, the last verse, come on! Anything you can fucking think of. 
She's the meanest. She sucks the horse's penis. She's the meanest of the horse's ass. Ever since they found it, all they do is pound it. They're the meanest of the horse's ass. Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, very sad, very sad. He used to be a real hatchet. Well okay, yeah. Anything else that I'm forgetting? Before the hatchet went there. Announcements. Oh, well, yeah, announcements. Oh. Oh. No one asked. Is there a hike this week? 1.30? Short hike. Where from? Oh, the place you don't know, Anchorage. <laughs> 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 Any other announcements? <laughs> Well, what was the what, what was the ripple state? Fine dining establishment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's unkind again. Come on, stop. <laughs> Do we have any other announcements? He didn't fucking go over. Isn't there a hash? He didn't go over. A hash what? Oh dear! Oh! Oh my goodness! There is a there is a hash hike. Well, okay, I'll, I'll announce it. Next week the uh, Super Cash is doing a run up in Poon Docket. We've been assured it will be an actual run this time, not just a walk around on the concrete. And the um, some people will be staying in Poon Docket overnight. I believe we've been given permission, if you want to, you can stay on the Dick compound there if you take a tent or something. Or, of course, they had hotels in Poon Docket themselves. I think most of the hotels go for about 1500 I think. It's a little bit expensive. The next day is a hike. It's a two-day hike. We'll be staying, because it's too long to do in one day. We'll be climbing high peak, right? Uh, you have to basically climb up, camp overnight, and then go up to the top and come down the next day. So it'll be a little bit strenuous. Jeez. Probably have to carry a tent or something okay, up because it's, it's cold up there at night. But anyway, that's next Tuesday and Wednesday. <coughs> Tuesday and Wednesday, right? Yep. Excuse me. Now, as far as transportation, as far as I know, uh, Terry, myself, and Howard are driving as of right now. Is anybody else driving? Well, Meatless be okay. Maybe Meatless may be back if he's driving. He may be, but we'll, we'll announce more about it in next week's circle in case everybody needs a ride. But it's going to be very strenuous. Uh, personally, oh, well, okay. Well, that's not the next announcement. Uh, we're going to have a motorcycle ride that Tuesday. Howard and I are going to see if we're going to get to the campsite on our motorcycles. If so, we'll come back and get the beer and take it up to the camp. <laughs> uh, Sounds sensible. Well, we're going to get as high as we can in four-wheel drive, then take the bikes off the back and go on the bikes. So we're quite sure we can get up there on our bikes. Anyway, hats and headbands off for the Hessian Anthem. Let's see, I think the last time we did this, it was the Korean verse, wasn't it? So we'll do the one about the lieutenant this week. She married a lieutenant to the States. States. Our hopes and dreams of all of our girls here. But after wintering my heart, she's frozen a little twat. And so all we need to find her man to be. And it's him to our high. I see it raining diamonds from the sky. Sit around Fifth Avenue and fuck the thing in my mouth. It's only 5.30, we got about a half hour before it gets dark.